Hello, everyone, and welcome to On the Pulse with Fingerprint. Uh, my name is Aida, and uh, today's topic is the first biometric payment launch down in France. Uh, with me, I have my colleague, Roger. And uh, so let's say hi to him. Hi, Roger. How are you? Hello, Aida. Good. Thank you. Great. So, Roger, I want to know who are you and uh, tell me a little bit about yourself uh, on your personal level, but also you're working at Fingerprints. So I also want to know what you're doing at Fingerprints. Sure. Pleasure. So my name is Roger Carisso. I'm born in Portugal and raised in France. I'm married and we live in Orléans, which is approximately one hour south of Paris in the famous Loire Valley. Probably you know Ida. It's a lot of historical castle. I have two fantastic twins uh, who are uh, ten years old, curious, talkative, and uh, keep me alert, you know, and preventing me from resting in my sofa. Believe me. <laughs> so I I joined fingerprint cards uh, four years ago to drive our smart card strategy with a top uh, worldwide card manufacturers in in this uh, banking card industry. I've been myself in this industry for almost 20 years. Uh, today, I'm heading uh, the payment segment of, uh, of fingerprints. So I'm very excited today about what is going on in, right now in France with the first commercial launch of a biometric banking uh, card. Yeah, the so, so if I understand it correctly, a couple months ago, you received uh, a biometric payment card and uh, you've been using it for a while now but i want to know how was your experience receiving it at your door but also how did you do your enrollment and also were you nervous you the first time you did your purchase or tell me tell me more yeah absolutely uh, the bnp bank has launched the the first deployment uh, end of last year and and as you said i'm a lucky man i have a, my own a, a biometric card today uh, so the first word I would say, it's a unique experience, you know, um, I had to go to the BNP branch to do the enrollment. Um, well, the, the employee gave me a very good indications. He made me, he feel, it made me feel very comfortable for during the enrollment process. Honestly, it was easy and safe. Uh, you have to put your pin code uh, once uh, you, you do uh, the, the, the first steps of the enrollment and 10 minutes later, it was done, so I could go with my first purchase. So talking about the, the first purchase, I have to say it brings the, this uh, wow effect. Uh, you don't touch anymore the terminal, so you feel super safe. You wave your card like a classic contactless card, and done. You see the green light LED blinking, and uh, the payment is approved. That's great. So what would you say... Uh, the keywords are for you as a customer using this card? Yeah, first, I would say easy and convenience. You know, during this pandemic effect, no one wants to touch anymore the terminal. So, I mean, it's a, it's a safe approach, you know, during the payment. You, I, don't, I don't tap any my PIN code anymore. So that's the first thing. And the second thing, it's a, it's a convenience. Uh, because whatever is the amount of the 50 euros, I just wave my card and it's paid, right? So it's a... It brings me security and convenience at the same time. BNP is bringing this innovation. I mean, they, they have started the handoff last year, a, a soft launch, but we a first deployment with a few happy few customers, I would say. And now they took the decision to massively deploy this in France. So BNP is the first uh, French bank, second in Europe, and they are being partnering with Visa, which is a worldwide uh, leading company as a scheme, global scheme. And they have a BNP, they have a strong partnership with Thales, which is a leading company in the, in the smart card industry. All right. So you as a customer, what, what value do you get out of having this card in your wallet? Again, I feel safe as a customer because, I mean, it brings the security for worldwide uh, high class of, of technology, best of the art, I would say, in terms of security and very the same way, similar way that we have a a banking card in our wallets today. All right. So uh, let me just ask you a couple more questions regarding to, to the payment card. Uh, I was wondering, of course, this should be a feature, right? An extra feature on your card. What kind of costs are involved as a customer having this extra on your card? Yeah, again, that's a good question because it's always the question, 
I have a new security features and I have a convenience. What should be the cost? But I can tell you that uh, as a gold member at BNP today, I'm paying one euro per month, which is, uh, if I have to compare this in France, it's uh, more or less the price of a French baguette, right? So it's not so too much. only one extra euro a Absolutely. Month? Or a, a coffee, an espresso, for example, mm -hmm. is more or less one euro. I think it's a matter of... Um, of uh, customer adoptions. I think that everybody's ready today to feel safe when we pay. And if I lose my card, you know, what happens to, the, uh, to, my, to my banking card, you know? And, and uh, the market has raised the, the limit of payment today to 50 euros in some countries, especially yeah. in Europe. So if I lose my card, I want to feel safe, right? And, and that's the purpose of this innovation today. So I feel safe I, and, and the bank will bring me security while I pay. We all know now that uh, this card is available in France, but I also mm. wanted to know uh, how is go the pricing going in West of France, mm. in Europe, but also globally? Is there market ready, so to speak? Yeah, absolutely. I think this is a, a we have to think about a massive change, you know, because uh, it will be a total different behavior. I think everybody is looking to get security and convenience, and I'll give you a few examples. For example. Who thinks about putting a pin code to unlock your smartphone today? Like you, you unlock your, 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 your phone with your fingerprint, right? Yeah. Who thinks about opening a roadmap today? I mean, you, you use uh, the GPS and digital maps, right? Yeah, of uh, course. Who thinks about buying a CD? <laughs> uh, we stream music online, right? So when it comes to an empower the user experience, uh, using a biometric card brings that convenience. So this is uh, why we see those changes happening. Yeah. 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 Makes sense. So basically, you could say that having biometrics on a credit card today is the future of payments, right? Absolutely. And 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 for those reasons and change in behavior, uh, I feel uh, safe. And this is why the customers uh, they will see this as a future and a great innovation for 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 daily payments. Yeah. Yeah, all right. But but uh, I was wondering, so some of the listeners, perhaps, and uh, people that are new to this biometric, uh, biometric method, they might be wondering, <clears throat> when I do my enrollment, where does my data get stored? So where will, who will own my personal information? Is it owned by the bank? Is it on the card? Or where does it get stored? Yeah, that's a good good question. I feel as a customer, I feel safe because the 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 data. As soon as you do the enrollment, the data is stored in, in the chip, right? So once, and, and nowhere else. So it is done once, and every time you you do a payment, there is a comparison between the live capture of your own fingerprint and the data stored in the, into the chip. So there is no reason to be to be afraid of that. Yeah. So that does that also mean that in case I lose the card, nobody else can use it, right? Absolutely. So if if someone stole your card or if I lose myself the card, uh, someone will try to put his fingerprint. But uh, again, same process. It will be a comparison will be done. And so and 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 fail the payment or because of that. Yeah. And it's not even possible to do payment with a signature. No, 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 no. The, the payment will be rejected immediately. Oh, okay. So that sounds very safe, actually. Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> You're a very lucky man having this card in your wallet. True, true. And I feel safe as a yeah. customer. Absolutely. Great. I hope in the near future, I will also have this card. But for now, thank you very much for giving us an update uh, on this biometric payment launch done in France. We're very excited for you. Hopefully, it will be in near future in everybody's wallet. But until then, perhaps we can talk soon again. Absolutely. Let's talk soon about my experience. Yeah. yeah. Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you, Aida. Bye. Bye.